Factsverse presents… What would happen if an asteroid hits Earth? Number 1. Asteroids are always passing by. It's not uncommon to read about asteroids flying by the Earth and nearly missing us. In all of the stories, NASA says that these asteroids won't ever come close enough for us to be worried. When people think about asteroids hitting Earth, they think about what happened to the dinosaurs. Many people believe that an asteroid hit Earth and it wiped out the dinosaurs and 80% of every living thing on the Earth. It was this direct hit that made it possible for humans to avoid being taken over by the dinosaurs. Number 2. What would happen if an asteroid hit Earth? Thanks to Hollywood, we have a few ideas regarding what might happen if an asteroid were heading directly towards our planet. In the movie Armageddon, starring Bruce Willis, NASA sent a drilling team to the asteroid to blast it apart to save the world. Before that happened, however, smaller pieces of the asteroid hit the Earth and destroyed certain cities in the world, killing millions. Fortunately, the drilling team was able to blast the largest asteroid, saving the world. In another movie that came out around the same time called Deep Impact, there was an asteroid heading toward the Earth. NASA had their astronauts attempt to divert the asteroid. In preparation, the leaders of the world and many others headed to a cave that was built years earlier to save selected people. The astronauts were able to destroy part of the asteroid saving the world. These movies have some truth because NASA and our government does have plans in place if an asteroid were heading towards Earth. Number 3. What happens if there is a direct hit? Scientists believe that if an asteroid that is six miles across were to hit the Earth, it would blast a crater into the Earth's crust. It would release a massive amount of energy that would be strong enough to vaporize the crater. There's a good chance that all life would not be destroyed. There would be people around to enjoy post-apocalypse life. Number 4. A Few Months Warning If an asteroid this large was heading towards Earth, we would likely see it a few months before it hits. This may not seem like much time when you think about what needs to be done to save yourself. Most people can't dig a nuclear bunker in the time that it would take to save themselves. The best way to save yourself is to travel to the opposite side of the world than the asteroid is expected to hit. Next, you would need to get underground or underwater. Number 5. The Time of Impact If you are unable to get away in time, you would be able to see an amazing show. You won't be able to see the asteroid in the sky until 24 hours before it hits. It'll shine in the night sky, but it'll likely look like a new planet. About two and a half hours before impact, you'll see it shooting towards Earth. When it reaches the Earth's atmosphere, it will fall in silence while it travels at many times the speed of sound. Number 6. A Direct Hit When the asteroid hits the Earth, it would be the equivalent of 100 trillion tons of dynamite blowing up on Earth. It would also be the equivalent of a billion Hiroshima bombs being released. The thermal radiation would cause the trees, grass, even your clothing to ignite immediately. If you were at the point of impact, you would suffer from third-degree burns all over your body at best-case scenario. At worst, you would become an atom. Every tall standing structure within 124 miles would be flattened instantly. The noise you would hear is the same as if you put your ear right up against a jet engine during takeoff. If you're able to survive a direct hit, your problems aren't even close to being over. Number 7. Global Fallout If you are able to survive the hit, it's likely because you were on the opposite side of the world. The seismic shocks on your side of the world will damage bridges, landslips, and dams, causing extreme flooding. The skies will darken, blocking the light of the sun. The superheated atmosphere will cause forests to go up in flames. The only way to survive this is to get into a nuclear bunker. Number 8. Acid Rain Eventually, the heat in the atmosphere will cool down. The cooling down will cause rain. Acid rain. It'll cause all of the plant life to die, leaving you with nothing to eat. Unless you have years of food already saved in your bunker, you will starve to death. Number 9. A Chance at Life If you were able to survive this long, you might actually make it. You can use the seeds in stores to grow crops for food. We can even use technology for vitro meat production. 
The reason the dinosaurs didn't make it was because they didn't have the type of technology that we do, nor did they have any time to prepare. Number 10. A Tiny Population If you are able to live this long, you are one of few. This means that it's up to you to create a new society, to create a new world, to repopulate the world. It might seem scary, but if you are able to survive the blast and the aftermath, you can make it through this. Number 11. We are safe According to scientists, something like this will only happen once every billion years. That means you don't need to spend your life savings to build a bunker to hold up in during the devastation. Also, NASA does have ways to save mankind in this type of situation. The next time you read a story on the news about a closely passing asteroid, don't worry, the chances of what happened to the dinosaurs happening to us are slim to none. Subscribe for more!